This okay. Just to open the see um, yesterday we had uh, one of you to please unmute yourself if you're not talking. Um, we had this question of auto recovery, right? So I told you, um, I just told you, but I told I'll show you to, uh, uh, in the next class. So for showing you, I had to force uh, shut down my system. So what happened? See, we had a um, force shutdown that is um, the charge went or whatever um, X Y Z reason it is. So this is how you get your recovery document to your left so this shows document recovery and then um, you will get what all was open when you force wow. shut down the uh, system so I had these two um, workbooks open so automatically this is the original one so when I click it's open so this opens so I don't want it then I will press close so automatically it is auto recovered see it is auto recovered as there is nothing here in this so there's nothing what you need to uh, recover because we did not do anything much in the last class so this is what it was and it's there as it is even though we did not so that's how you auto recover your books so this will be the sheet two that is for today's date so Save, save as. Just want you to put some ten names. Ten names and marks. what select uh, to select it will be selected using the mouse or uh, you will select it holding shift key and right arrow you will select so for example now I want to select the whole data then I will click on control shift and right arrow down arrow I repeat to just select one or two you can just hold shift and select right arrow down arrow like this so if you want to select the whole data then you will select control shift right arrow down arrow and select the whole data control plus c to copy okay copy copies your um the data from the source to the destination data that is it will remain in the source data and destination data for example this is my source data here 
I will control plus V that is based. This is my um, destination data, I repeat. So you can just select here you also you have copy. So wherever you want, you keep your cursor, you have paste. So from the source data to the um, destination data, but you can see the there is this marquee still. That means this data is still, still selected. Okay, that means it is still copied. There is some processing still going on. So you you can paste it more number of time. Control C. Oh, I'm sorry. Control V. Again, I can do Control V. It is pasted. But again, you can do this. It is pasted. But you see the um, marquee is still there. That is, it is still, the process is still going on. So either you use some other process, the, this process goes in another, like if you do copy somewhere else, for example, I will do this this part, I will only copy the name. So I will do control C, see here, there is no marquee here. That means the process is here. Now. I'm just doing undo. Or when there is marquee here, you want to paste it only once. Okay, you don't want so many times, you want to paste it only once. Then you press enter. Enter ends this process and it will be ready for the next process. So whatever that's going on, you can just do it. So I repeat, in Excel, paste can also be done by using enter key. Okay. Now, what it does is it will remove your data from this source and it will give you the data in the destination source that is select okay control x to cut okay. i will paste it here so you can see the difference now between copy and cut Here also same enter you do it will paste it just doing and okay before i go to different part of this i will do this okay now you can change the font styles okay and you change the font size, bold, italic, underline. You increase the font size, you decrease the font size. So you can give some highlightings. You can change the text colors. Okay, so these are the borders. You can give some borders, thick border. So you can see the difference. You can give it to the table, thick border. Okay, now see, you can see that there is difference between this name and this name right so if i copy i will paste so same as this name and this name is the same but whatever the um, color or the styles i have given to this i want it in this okay so this is the name so i will write here write here as m is So this, if I copy and paste it, 
see it is as name but i don't want it to say name i want this as ms office only but the color must be this so then we need to use the option called format painter that means this will copy this option copies only the format of this text to this text okay or this anything any Just select this click on format painter you get this option select okay i repeat keep your cursor on the format you want keep click on format painter and click on the text doing it again click on format painter select you want it for the data just select it like this okay format painter so now uh, what i want you to do is i want you to type a data like this 10 names 10 marks and i want you to copy paste it thrice that is one two three okay and then first one first data keep as it is these two datas i want you to change its formats or all these options you must put complete two different datas okay all these options font size font size increase decrease bold italic underline uh, borders highlights and text change so you will do it for this as well as all these okay all of this one one and two date is it clear did you understand what i told yes ma'am yes, yes ma'am ma yes ma'am do it now what i want you to do is you have to do it take a picture and send in the group can you repeat ma'am yes i told one ten names and marks you need to type like this copy paste it twice keep this data as it is that is because we will require this for um, for the use this data i want you to change the or use all of this complete one data and second data don't use the same um, styles or same size or bold italic same don't do same same do different okay Maybe I'll give you five minutes. So most of them I want you uh, to put a picture there so that I know you're working. Do it.
any doubts if you're getting. No, ma'am. Ma'am, can you explain once again how to do uh, that pasting, ma'am? Okay. What pasting, dear? Can you be a little? Can you lock it? Mm, class, why you done whatever I did? That is not how I want you to do. Mm, see. Am I supposed to do anything else, ma'am? Stuti, yes. See, you are not supposed to. Whoever have done this, no? That is Stuti, Ritu, um, Ritika and all. So what I want you to do is, um, I want you to change each. Okay, I will only show once. See, uh, what I want you to do is, I want you to like, give a heading like this. change like um, Something, it's not like you have to do what I am doing. Something like this. something like this so for the whole data I want you to do the changes this I'll give bold italic line leave the whole I'll give all borders then I'll give thick outside borders Did you get it, everyone? Hmm. So people who have done for like one one, please change it to do it for the whole data. Hello, ma'am, I got disconnected. Can you please repeat what you were saying? Mm, till where have you taken? What, what is that you want me to explain? Ma'am, uh, the name and mark, how you got the um, red box. This part. You just select uh, each one and you give the bold italic underline and then you give some um, colors different text colors and different highlighting colors okay and then you give, you change the um, different styles for the whole data so that's what i want you to do for two datas 
and take a picture and send it in the group. Done. I see most of you have sent. Hmm. Yeah, this is right. This is how I want. Okay, now uh, when I said paste, we still have many different ways of paste. So, for example, I'll just select this part. Copy it. Okay, I will paste it here. So when you click on when you click on the drop down list, you can see the number of types of a uh, paste. So paste this is the regular paste. Wait, I'll show it here so that you can see. So this is the paste with the formula so if you have formulas you can see see in this one you got to know the difference like what is that i copied here see what is that i copied i have copied this part please mute if you're not talking so this one of you was Unmuted, please, or you can ask me the doubts if you have. I cannot keep track of you all the time. Ma'am, can you increase the size of the screen, please? Yeah. This is not visible. I'm to see your screen. No? This is visible. Class, this is visible. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. So now um, you can see that this is what I have copied, right? So there are formats here, different styles, different size, and all. 
I will when I am pasting it here for the formulas. So here this is only the text that is required for a formula. If you have formulas, so that time we will be pasting only this. So this says formula and number format. That means um, only all whatever is there in the text so that will be added. So further, if you have a data with formulas and I know that time you get to know the differences. So keep the source formatting. That means as you have copied, the same will be pasted here. Okay. Then you have is the borders. So you can see here the source format has borders. We have given borders to the data, but here no borders. That means the borders are not being seen when you paste here. And here keep this column width. Why is this? See, for example. So what I will do is I will decrease or you can increase the Now keep the source column width. Width is the same, but in case you are just pasting it here, see you can see the column width is not the same. Whatever the column here, this part column is the same thing. It will paste it. I'll just show you. I'll paste and show you the difference. See, I'm doing this with the format as it is. So only the source is the same, not the column. But the same way I will. column width. See, you get to know the difference of the paste here. Then you have this transpose. Transpose is rows to columns, columns to rows. So it will transpose. Then you have like if you have values, only the values to be pasted only the formulas with the formulas to be pasted keep the source formatting with the values so if there is any changes that will be the same so only the paste link that is only if it, if it is a link on it will paste it as a link so this and all further uh, when we are pasting you will get to know like what is the differences so now what i want you to do is i want you to copy the uh, data which you have uh, changed. Yeah, tell me. Uh, ma'am, ma'am, actually, I'm using my tablet, and I don't have that paste option on my tablet. So, what do I do? Mm -hmm. Why is why is why is that you don't have? Okay, tablet. Uh, why you you don't have? Even I have my it? tablet. You will not have, you can see in the launches, just click here. Um, no. Maybe you just have to skip this or you can try it when you're doing it in the laptop or a desktop. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah. Maybe in the assignment type, you can just type your names. So later when you will do it in the... Um, your phone, I mean, your laptops or anything, then you can send me the pictures. Now, what you do is, you do it for the first data, what you have changed, done the changes. So I want you to paste all these, all these types, like one, two, three, four, five, six times. Okay, paste it six times. Reduce the zoom of your, um, uh, sheet okay zoom it in and then take um, picture and send it to the group 
Am I clear? Do you want me to repeat it? Will do it. Yeah. Mom, how many times you have to do? All this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times you'll paste it. Okay. Mom, can you repeat? So I want you to take the first, copy the first data and paste it seven times using all these four different types of uh, paste specials. Okay, and then you will uh, reduce the zoom so that everything comes under one picture. So because I don't want you to put many pictures in one, one student will have one picture. It will not be confusing for me. And then you take the picture of this sheet and you send me. Is it clear? Ma'am, can you repeat? Yeah. Okay. So what I want you to do is copy one of the data, paste it seven times. That is different types of paste specials. These special seven times. Reduce the zoom and uh, take a picture of the sheet and send it in the group. Mom, uh, but when we paste it in, uh, that's the second and third way. That's formulas and uh, formulas and number formatting. It seems to be the same. Yeah, it is the same until unless you don't have any formulas here. So now we, we it's just a basic data. So it is the same. But when we are using formulas, I'll come back to this topic again. So that time you get to know the difference. So that is why I want you to do it now. Okay, ma'am. Um, Sandhya or whoever has sent a picture now. Um, so, uh, it, you have not done all the seven there. Whose ever number is like five, last five, three, three. Tell me.
only 15 of you it doesn't take much time to just copy and paste it Ritu. Ritu. Yes, ma'am. Mm. You have not done it properly. You have not done it properly. Okay, ma'am, I'll do it again. Excuse me, ma'am. Yeah, tell me. Uh... I am pasting it, but the same thing is coming, ma'am. It's not uh, formatting it, ma'am. I mean, you're not getting the formats. You can just send. Yes, ma'am. You can just. I'm send getting the same thing. Yes, ma'am. You're using different formats. You're using. Yes, ma'am. Because if you click here, only click here, then it you get the same thing. You no, ma'am. I'm using this. Uh, Format still, I'm not getting it now. Okay, yeah, transports. Transports also, I'm not getting it, but so I'm getting the picture. same thing. Yes, uh, maybe you can share your screen and show me. Ma'am, my paste option is not opening. What paste option? This, this part? This part? You, yes, should, you should click on the below, below down arrow. Drop down, you should click. Okay. Excuse me, ma'am. Should I send you okay. personally or in the group, ma'am? In the group only. Put it in the group. That's okay. Okay. Yes. I can't share because uh, you have to admit me, ma'am. Share my Yeah, no. That is what I will share. The, you can. I will share you. I mean, I will make you the presenter. Give me a second. What is your name? Maria Rachel, ma'am. Maria Rachel. T. Maria Rachel, right? Yes, ma'am. Hmm. You can share the screen now. Yes, ma'am.
Yeah. Uh, so I I'll do it again and show you, ma'am. Yeah, yeah, do it, do it. You just do it. You don't have to explain. You can just just work. I'll see. Ma'am, it's asking we can't paste because the copy area and yeah, I'll tell you what you are doing. Close that. Okay. Do okay. Okay, ma'am. I so did. yeah. Uh, copy that. Copy, copy your data first. Uh, one second. I guess it's copied. Okay. Come. Uh, keep your cursor in S one. S1. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Now click on the down uh, paste drop down button. Paste, ma'am. Paste, paste drop down button. Where is the paste? Uh, now, now click on formats. You're getting now? Okay, yes, 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 ma'am. Mm, that's how you're supposed to do. Okay, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. I uh, I should yeah. You can stop sharing. Yes. Okay, anyone else? Everyone is able to do. See these these are um few important topics okay like pair special options you'll be using it simple options but you'll be using them okay next now you had the data here right for example now i have just copy paste it in a different without the format side paste. Ma'am, your screen isn't visible. Okay, Not shared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot. Now it's visible. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Now, what I will do is okay. you can see here the name of the student is in A58, but you can see only name of why because the student there's one more cell here, so it is not being seen, but there is the name of student here. For example, I'll write it here. name of student so you can see it is in e58 but when i click on f58 there is nothing that is because the cell is empty the cell where name of student is is in a58 only i want to increase one option you have you can increase the column so you just double click like this you can increase the column or if it is in like more this you can just increase this height also row height column width row height you can increase just to undo but then what happens if i use the uh, if i increased the 
uh, column the whole, whole column will get increased no i want to adjust this in this cell then there is an option called wrap text you just click on wrap text see wrap text it will wrap the data in one wrap text see it will wrap into one that is what wrap text is used i will repeat it so if you want to wrap the whole uh, sentence in one cell then you wrap text click on the cursor click on wrap text okay now for example marks i have few marks here as well you think I have here three marks okay but marks is in the heading only of this cell correct I want marks is this I want marks is this so what we can do is we can merge this cell select all of three and click on merge and center so you have different options you can merge, merge across merge the cell only you don't have to keep them in the center and much it will remove so I repeat to merge select three then click on margin center wrap text margin center do it do the same way how i did copy paste the data without formats into, a, into one more cell and do this you don't have to send the picture now just do it Now, any doubt in this? Wrap text in Merchant Center. Is it clear? Everyone? Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Next, what we'll have is you will the alignments part. So, you have this top, center, bottom. I repeat, top, center, bottom. See, if you do it here in this cell, top, center, bottom. Ma'am, it is not working in my system. It is not working. It only works in your system. Why is that? Because see, the cell is smaller size. Even though it goes up, down and center, you will not be able to see. Because the cell is small. Same way, if you increase the row height, see, center down. Okay. That's why if you do it for this, because in your the cell row height is increased here. So you can do it for this top center bottom. So we'll keep it for center. Same way, left, center, right. So basically here in the below data, you can observe that see the alphabets are to the left and numbers. This is only numbers are to the right. So by default in Excel, the alignment for alphabets, that is the characters are left and the numbers are right. Okay, characters to the left and numbers to the right. And then you can change it. It's not like you cannot change the alignments. But by default, it will be like this. You can change the alignments however you want to. So I'll keep this in the center now. So this is the uh, indent. So this is to move one point left one point right not your left not your right indent 
then you have is the orientations. So you have clockwise, angle clockwise, vertical, rotate, rotate takes down, anti-clockwise. So all these type of uh, data you can do. Now uh, names you can copy paste okay any any doubt in these alignments orientations um this anyone oh uh, ma'am can you please tell how you have edited these marks one this this is the orientation this is part is orientation let's click here clockwise and and click clockwise Vertical rotate angle clockwise, so you can do it in different ways. Yeah, In this put of your choice what i want you to do is name of student subject one two three four five six you will merge the text and then you leave six subjects here okay six subjects give 10 marks 10 10 10 10 i mean 10 names you can just copy paste the names If different um, subjects English maths physics whatever you want to and then you give the names here you give the um, numbers here marks here give different marks uh, this data will use will we'll be using it further so keep the marks different and keep some fail pass distinction marks as also okay uh, those kind of data one data and then you give uh, this also in them like all of this bold italic put borders put highlights put this so the whole part you will use this this full okay in this data so before you do that I'll just show you this uh, paste options in the launcher. So what you do is you just, you can see the arrow mark there. You just have to click. So here you can see what are all the recent uh, copies you had done. I mean paste you had done. So it's usually what happens here. I mean what happens is when you copy and paste it, you will not know what you've copied. Again, you have to copy it and paste it. But here in this part, you can paste it for example you want to paste this again click see it will paste click see it will paste okay it will paste yeah I, I forgot to do that that time so i just showed you now so this data you will do whole data Okay, now you copy paste one of the data okay, and then the rest of the marks. But don't give same marks. Please keep, do change, do the changes in the marks. Okay, and uh, give the heading here as data one. Data one. do it send a picture so uh, 
whatever I've done. I'll just open the notes as well. You don't have to write down everything. But uh, that's what as I told you in the last class. This was done. You were taking this. Class, you are taking this. At least one can answer me in the class. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Then next. This also you are taking, I remember. We had taken for new, but not for print, ma'am. Mm -hmm. This one? Yes, ma'am. In this, you had showed us how to do a new one, but in print, we did not do that. Okay. And to be print, usually, um, I will show you when you're doing with the page layout tab, because that's where the all basic print things are there so that time i will come back there for it but you can write down the shortcut keys Ma'am, can you show the previous slide? This one, right? This one.
Excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am, uh, can you uh, go back to explaining how you turned the marks from being horizontal to um, to uh, an angle? Take only the first two topics of the graph text. Can you, 
anyone has any doubts anyone Mom, can you explain how you changed marks from being horizontal to an angle? Yes, Sanchana. Sanchana? Yes, Sanchana. If you were not audible. You are not audible. Audible. <laughs> Mom, can you hear me now? No. Open up. Am I the only one who cannot hear you? Or Why not? Maybe you can just text. Maybe you can. I can see you are talking, but I cannot hear you. Excuse me, ma'am. Give me a second, I'll see you. Archie is also talking. One second, one second. Ma'am. Okay. Can you try talking now? Can you try talking now? Can you try talking now? You can hear me talk. Can you can hear me talk. Eh, eh. Yes, ma'am. We are able to hear you. Yes, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Class, you can hear me talk. Tuti? Yes, ma'am. We are able to hear you. I need your car. Okay. Uh, Sanchana. I need your car. Sanchana, can you please? I need your car. I need your car. Okay. I will take your attendance through this only because I see a lot of you will not be able to unmute, say yes. It is difficult for me to take a Okay, class. Any doubt in today's class? No, ma'am. Ma'am, ma'am. No, ma so, yeah, tell me. Ma'am, I have one doubt. Hmm. Archie, tell me. Ma'am, like uh, one, how to increase the cell size of one cell and then afterwards like normal cell size. Like the one girl, one girl has sent in the group. The one, 
Yes, ma'am. The one I have sent with a dot. Uh, what she has done is she has uh, only highlighted uh, the marks obtained uh, merged. She has merged only K, L, and M. Okay, the rest of the thing she has not merged. So that's why when you put the borders, it is showing that it is not merged, and that is why you are getting the borders there. So you, she has merged only K, L, and M instead of I to O. Yeah. Okay, ma'am. So, why is that very less people have sent? Maybe like three, four of you have sent. Anyways, you get time to tomorrow's class. So, you can send me the list. The attendance, as I told, I will take it from there. Maybe in between, like, um, a weekly once or weekly twice, I'll just recheck. I'll just open my... Um, attendance file and you can just check that once like if I've put that right wrong we can just have discussion on that it is calling out and then later you answer so that's it's not tallying up okay so okay so any doubts in today's class I don't want to take another topic that's initial classes. I don't want you to give a lot of practical, so later on we'll have more practical one by one classes. Course. So we are good to go. You can wind up the class. Yes, ma'am. Please, ma'am. Yes, right, ma'am. Ma ma uh -huh. Okay. Anyways, thank you, class. See you tomorrow at six thirty. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. Bye bye. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am.